First, let's introduce ours, uh, myself also. So uh, uh, I run a, a very little internet only shop that is devoted to HP. HP were my, was my passion when I was a young student. I'm an engineer working in a very boring financial position in a multinational. So as a side, uh, as a side business, I have created something that allows me to enjoy my hobby without losing money. Something that uh, it, it's an advantage about most of you. So um, we found I founded the company in 2011 when the HP 15 LE uh, was launched. We sell HP calculators, both old and new, and we are a Moravia distributor. Also, we design accessories, cases, overlays and cables and parts for calculator repair. And uh, we also perform calculator repairs. In this, uh, Ignacio Sanchez, who some of you may know, is, uh, is helping me and he has taught me most of the repair techniques. And we have developed together some of them. So, what about the HP 15? Um, uh, Cyril de Brevison, who was in HP, took the opportunity to make some changes based on our input, Moravia and the uh, Ana key user group. So we increase the memory up to 196 registers instead of 65. Um, more program steps than anyone could reasonably use in, in the right mind. The battery life was extended. So I think it's around one year of, of frequent use while it's not as long as the original, that was many years, but it's still a, a, good, uh, a good life. Then it came with three modes. One, the official mode, safe mode, where nothing can go wrong. Then an unleash mode where there are several things can go wrong. For example, you can go over 1000 program steps or you can have uh, 13 times 13 uh, matrices that of course will not invert properly, but uh, you have 196 registers and you can do many things. And then uh, another hidden mode that was an HP 16C, which was uh, both the Unleashed and the HP 16C were not manufacturing, uh, manufacturer supported. It was kind of a gift from Cyril. So, and uh, it is open to future enhancements because it has a USB protocol POGO connector. And finally, uh, several members of, of this honorable council were uh, took a part in the development and, and the ideas and the selection of features to be used. So, enhancing the HP 15C. So we start with a, a very useful tool with many features and we want to enhance it. So, we might end up with something that is a little bit unwieldy. So how, how to do it in a way that can, can be used? Uh, first of all, the HP 16C, no, not manufacturer supported, how, how to use it? 
First of all, we discovered early on that it had a very, very nasty bug. We made it basically a toy, not something that could be used. But uh, Jean-Francois Garnier provided a fix quite early on that uh, uh, Cyril was able to put into the system and or we could retrofit it. But the important thing here is that uh, we design a Pogo cable to fix it. It, it is curious because Hewlett Packard didn't have not neither the cables nor the knowledge on how to use uh, to produce more. They didn't know who had produced it. They didn't have the, the plans. So we need to start from scratch and had to design the, the, the cable head at the beginning. Looking at what was available off the shelf, it happens that this um, uh, the connectors are two millimeters uh, uh, of distance between different connectors, while the um, uh, market standard is 2.54 millimeters. So it's uh, nothing was compatible, so we had to design it from scratch with the help of, of course, Chinese uh, companies. But we had to draw it from the beginning. So, uh, and also they, uh, to use the HP-16, there is a different keyboard set. So we designed also with the help of, of Chinese companies a silicon overlay with three colors and, um, and that could be put on top the, of, the, of the keyboard. And now what? So Cyril has programmed. Um, one second. A program, a simple input output that puts the calculator in USB HID mode. And with that, we are able to read and write the whole memory area. It's worth noting that the HID mode could be used as well to use uh, the calculator as a keyboard for your computer, as a numerical keyboard for the computer. That could be another development, but of course we need to change the connector so that it can rest horizontal on, on the table. Uh, he also created a very simple command line Windows only so far program for your just save. And then with that, you can back, and back up and restore the calculator, the whole calculator data. But once you are there, you say, okay, why don't we share program sets? Why don't we put together programs? Because we all recognize that programming the HP 15 is very cumbersome. And once you have made let's say three or four programs and you are on 200 program lines then uh, or 300 then it's a pain each time that you need to uh, to change batteries or 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 something has happened or the battery ends or if you want to put it into another calculator so we can share the program sets and someone that knows something, for example, Geoff on, on aviation, he can put together his love programs and then that's a software pack in exactly like we had on the HP 40, 41. And that can be shared. The problem that we had then is to have an, a proper overlay. So Geoff uh, provided two packs related to aviation. And then we, as I was working on finance, I put together the programs that I was using and then some on, some others and uh, I created a program, a finance pack. And we also did the overlays. 
So this uh, this is important for you guys if you want to create other uh, overlays. The first thing to know is that uh, minimum order quantity is three hundred units, at least with a with a producer that we know, at least three hundred units. So we have a three D. Uh, 3D model of the keyboard of the of the silicon overlay on which we put on top the the labels. Uh, we use the same codes, color codes, yellow for the keyboard plate, white on top, and uh, and blue on the angle part, and then. Um, the one second uh, and then the criteria is that of course the yellow on top of the function keys are it's clear how to to call it it's just pushing the function keys but uh, for the other possible labels we f we use yellow for the GBX, so for example, G G GBS, no, GSB7 would trigger, uh, for example, in the finance would trigger percentage T. GB uh, GSB8 would trigger minus tax. GSB nine would trigger a uh, difference of days and GSB point nine would use it uh, would uh, trigger date plus which would be a blue color uh, a blue colored um, overlay I, I wanted to show the actual overlays but we only have so far prototypes which are not perfect uh, so they are still uh, creating a proper prototype so that we can we can uh, in principle we should receive them uh, by the end of the month and uh, then they would be available for these two packs uh, aviation pack and finance pack but if you master one area and you have created a set of programs, we can create as well other. Can you hear me? Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm finishing fast. I'm finishing fast. Uh, how to develop Torsten Mann's HP 15 simulator. We'll have a HP 15 enabled version before year end that can read and write files uh, created with the HP 15 and later we'll have a direct connection. So you can, you will have HP 15 C support and you will have also uh, on the on menu, you could, you could do read and write programs. That's the way we have created the HP finance uh, uh, manual and also in order to to develop it, it allows you to create a text file with a description of the program it takes into account what are the program resources that you have used in your program set uh, labels storage registers and flags and also it gives you a fantastic and nice printout of the program that you have created. So uh, this uh, Torsten is expecting to do it before uh, year end, but I have a prototype that is working fine so far. And uh, that's uh, uh, just a little sales pitch for all of you, 10% off across the shop we uh, using this code on checkout.
So that's all. Does anyone have any questions? Uh, Jose, for your information, there's about 40 people here. I would be checking the website in a few minutes. That 10% off may stimulate some activity. Um, thank you for adjusting your schedule to meet our needs. And uh, I'll be talking to you later. Perfect. Bye.